It did it again. <laughs> Every time. Oh, sorry. I was putting some stuff away. Every time. So where were we? We were doing this eye, right? So, oh, let's have a look. Right, so we've curled it. Um, and I think in between me trying to get it back on again, it's lost its curl. So I'm just going to quickly do this one again. Sorry guys, so unprofessional. <laughs> well, we've got another half an hour now. <laughs> there we go. Okay, yeah, we're good with that, aren't we? So let's get that, so there we go, that's that done. Now listen, some people go back in once your lashes are dried and go ar, 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 and do it again. But please, if you're gonna do that, can you see that that already has got old mascara from whenever I last wore mascara? It's clearly not come off properly. Oh, hanging lash. Oh, heck, quick. Hang on, bear with. I got you. Yes. Yeah. Um, so if you are going to do that, make sure you clean these again, and please make sure that your eyelashes are super super dry. Not you think they're dry. Make sure they're super super dry, and it's perhaps the last thing you do before you even go out the door because if they are even a smidgen still tacky the mascara it will pull and you'll lose some of your lashes you will um so please make sure they're dry if you want to do that that's fine it, it, they're your eyes but just be careful please thank you right so let's do the other eye and then we'll do lips okay i might actually go under my eye with a little bit of dark just to see uh, See what happens. So bear with me. Can we do this one again? But yeah, I knew it's gonna cut out. It always does, doesn't it? It's like oh we've got 29 minutes and three seconds. Grr. <laughs> Excuse me putting my arm across, but it's just easier that way to make sure. That's the other thing as well. If you've got um if you've got any eyelashes that have come out and they're on your wand, take them off. You know, get your tweezers or whatever, or if you're not bothered, take them off with your, f your fingers, but take them off. Because all you'll do is put that um, detached lash in with your mascara and in with your other lashes. And it's highly likely once it dries, it, it's probably gonna fall off and go into your eye. So, uh, best not to, best not to have it there. Make sure your wand's nice and clean and not, you know, not clumpy and things like that. Because then all that's going to happen is the clumps are going to go straight onto your eyelashes. And you don't want that. Um, I do like wearing falsies. But not sort of during the day for me. It's more of a nighttime thing or if I go out, you know, once in the blue moon or, you know special occasions I will I will pop a set of falsies on from elf <laughs> because I can mm -hmm. so okay and a little bit of zigzagging across the bottom sounds rude though <clears throat> yes I know only to me Don't go mad on your bottom lashes because they can look really, really sort of clumpy and not not nice. Um, I've got super long eyelashes on the bottom. Just see Nemo's, they're like that. Whoosh, beautiful. It's got stunning eyes. 
He's going to be a proper little heartbreaker when he's older. Ow. Itchy. Mm. Allergies. Allergies. I hate this time of year. You know? You get all the pollen coming out. I think the pollen count here is quite high today, actually. Um, okay, so there we go. You see this one, because it's dried, it's dropped already, and that's what happens. I need some tech for clumps and anything I've missed. And then I'm going to go in with my comb. Because I've got a, a, a few gathering here, having a party at the end. Which is fine. I don't mind that at all. But I'm not invited, so I think they can stop that right now. <laughs> Right, with your mascaras, a good thing to do is in the winter when it's freezing cold, make sure you it's you your mascaras are warmer. You know, um, you can. I usually pop mine between my bosoms. Body temperature, thirty six degrees is what you want. Fab. Um, same with eyeliners, anything like that. You know, like the crayon kind, anything like that. Um, pop those down there as well or um, under your knees in between your knee you know under your knee if you're sat with your knees bent pop them under there just warms them up a bit which means that the product works better and quicker and you're not waiting ages and it, it's not as clumpy that's what I found over the years is to try and sort of you know warm things up I always warm these up as well so these go under my knees usually before I use them so that they're that bit warmer. If they're warmer, they curl better and they stay better. Um, so there you go, little quick tip for you. Um, but I'm sure you've probably seen it already a thousand times on a million get readies with me. <clears throat> so, right, I said I was gonna do a little bit of, a little bit of dark, didn't I? So that's what I'm gonna do. Um, I'm gonna pop this rose gold out of the way and I'm just going to go in with that that one there with my angled brush morning angle <laughs> sorry I can't, I can't help it I love um, the Cornetto trilogy <sighs> with the uh... ow trap my, trap my skin then with um, Simon Pegg and Nick Frost and they do all their films, I think they're great. I'm trying to remember what they're all called. There's one with the zombies in, isn't there? And then there's, what's the other one? Oh, where is the police sergeant? That's good. I like that one as well. Right, so can you See that, I've just popped a little bit, not all the way along as well, because if I put it all the way along, that's just gonna shut my eye right down, and I don't want that. Um, there we go. I might actually put some, yeah, it's a nice color. Let's put some at the top there. La 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 la. My contact lens is bugging me. There we go. Turn it around a bit. <laughs> Hot fuzz. That's where is the policeman. I also like Run. Uh, is it Run Fat Boy? Something like that. Where he competes um, to get to get the love of his life back. 
competes in a marathon or something crazy like that. He's never run before. I like that one, that's quite good. Hank Azar is in that one. Why am I, why am I waffling on about films? I don't know, you tell me. Hmm. Right, so what do we think so far? Are we, how do we like? Yes, if I can make it a bit closer. Right, that one isn't the same as that one, so I'm either going to have to take that down or add to that. Let's see. Mm, I think we'll take it down because we're going into school. <laughs> we're not going out to uh, a stripping club or anything like that, or dancing or dancing the night away. Right, where is it? Not that one. Bear with. Come on. There you are. So it's just this one, about that big. This is my correcting brush and my sort of concealer brush and all that sort of stuff. So what I'm going to do is go into my e.l.f. matte palette and use that one and just try and blend some of that away, okay? Because I do think it looks a little bit heavier than the other side. <sighs> Although I said, oh yeah, I really like it, I'm going to blend it up. I now think it mm, looks a, bit, a little bit too, too much for school. Just like you saw, we've still got a nice base. That's good. We'll do the same on the other side. Okay, that's better, isn't it? Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to even it up though. It's being a rascal, and then we'll do our lips. <laughs> there we go, gotcha. Better, yes. Okay, so eyes are done. I will show you something else that I use on my eyes sometimes, and it's blooming marvellous. It is Maybelline. <sighs> Maybelline. I can't even read that. Push up angel mascara and it basically it gives you wings. It gives you wings like Red Bull. But look, let me show you the wand. It's it's bizarre. But it works and it's awesome. When you go on a night out, you know, and you just want and you've got your falsies on. I use this before I put my falsies on. But look at that. Look at the wand. Okay, so can you see? And what you do is you you start you use the natural shape of your eye, so you would start there, and then take it up. So that the wing, if you look at it, pulls the lashes in the right direction when you're using it. So you know it's just a case of just just gently like that. So next time we do a tutorial. I'll use this, I'll show you, okay? Um, but for some reason that one's staying up and that one's not, so I might actually um, see if this will help. Just hold it for a little minute. good for the bottom ones as well because it's so small it doesn't mean you go like 
and get a big clump of mascara <laughs> underneath your lashes. So that's the eyes done, okay? So as I said, we're going for a summer bronzy look. We, we did the base, I showed you the highlight, we've done all that, we did the prep, now we're gonna do lips. So that's, that's dry now, okay? A little bit tacky, but it's dry and that means it's tacky but it's dry so that means that it will actually hold the product better and that's what you want so what i'm going to do now my lovies is line my lips this is a long lasting eye pencil do i care no it's not by elf <laughs> it's an a1 one actually but there you go easy so it's bronze so if I just, I can't see because the little, the little record things in the way, so I need to use my mirror, excuse me. And just start in the middle. And then. Gradually start to take it out. You can relax your lip, check it's okay. And then who's at my door? That beep boo. We have a chime on the door so we know if the door's been opened. So that Nemo doesn't go out onto the main road or any or you know, wander off or anything. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Actually, before I put my lips on, I have a drink of water. Right. So you don't need to be... Can you see it's got a slight little twinkle, a little, little sparkle in it? Okay. Now, with the bottom, I put my liner under my lip. That makes sense. put a little bit of liner just uh, now some people use a brush some people don't um, to apply I do So this is ELF, <laughs> oh yeah, I can't see that. This is ELF Touch of Nude. Now I like this colour because it, it will go with everything. Any colour you use on your face, this will go with it. It's fantastic. It's quite a sheer one, um, but I love it, so. I get on to the mirror again because I've got the recording right in the middle. <laughs> okay. See, the good thing about using a 
a brush is you can blend the line in so it's not as harsh. You don't look like, you know. Do you remember, oh, do you remember when you used to wear like really dark lip liner and then really light lipstick? Why? But there you go, it was the trend. I did it. There you go. And the same again on the top. You don't need a huge brush. This is just a, I mean, it's not massive, you know, but it just works for me. I like this brush, it's a good size. I can get where I need to get and there we go, so. Now, because that's nude, and looks quite sort of mm. at the minute, I'm going to show you a little trick. Now, this is from Elf as well. <laughs> um, but it's a lovely little glow. Um, I don't know if you can see. It's quite, you know, it's quite a lot of shimmer in there. Um, and oh, it, uh, I'll show you a little trick to make your lips look a teeny tiny bit bigger, okay? And more full. in the middle like that and on the top my eye looks lazy doesn't it come on eye what's going on I'm not playing today I might have to redo re recurl Definitely dry, so that's fine. Right, so well, on the top, you want to do it here. Can you see how thin the wand is as well? Mm, sorry. Come here down, Dory. Super, super thin. So you just like that. And there, my friends, is me. So while you're here, I will show you what I do if I'm going to recurl. Okay. First thing I do is grab my comb and just very carefully go through, make sure there's no clumps, lumps, bumps, cars, buses, trains. <laughs> there we go. And just okay. sure you get all of your lashes in that's the other thing because if you just get some in you're going to end up really hurting yourself when you take them off and very gently 
you will feel it if you do it too hard. It will hurt. And very, very slowly, just release and up and off. Okay? Go back with your comb. There you go. All done. So that was my get ready with me. Um, summer look. Um, so you know we've got bronzer, we've got highlighter. Um, I need to have a lot of colour on my face because I've got super grey hair and super short hair. So if I don't wear makeup. Um, I either look like a man, <clears throat> apparently, cheeky buggers, not with these breasticles, love I can tell you, um, or I, f I feel quite washed out if I don't have a little bit of colour on my face. So, there you go. Please leave any comments down below. I will put everything I've used in the description. Um, I just need to remember what, what I've used in the last four um vlogs but thank you for watching it means the world to me if you've enjoyed this or you want to see me do another look let me know down here um if you enjoy this and you want to see more and you think you might want to subscribe then slap that bell make sure you put all as well because they've changed it you might miss some of the um vlogs that i do and then you will be sad and i'll be sad too so thank you it's been a pleasure and I will see you soon. Lots of love. Take care. Bye.